Hey everybody, I know I haven't posted in a while, but, so basically I just, I'm assuming there was an update to YouTube and it all changed how to upload a video, but I am going to be doing a Fortnite Battle Pass review for Chapter 2 Season 6. Here... We have Agent Jonesy, one of the most anticipated skins practically all over the game. Then we have his banner icon. Then we have They Call Me. From scale 1 to 10, I'm rating this about a 5. It's a good spray, just kind of small. But Agent Jonesy, 10 out of 10. We, then we just have some V-Bucks and the Limited Jonesy. Honestly, very good. 10 out of 10. Then we have Jonesen. We actually saw him in that. We actually. That's actually on the, his style from the live event. Then we have Clean Sweep. Honestly, I really like this emo because it's transversal. Then. We have After Zero, which is the music that played during this season's live event. We also have Countdown to Zero. This trailer ha was definitely teased. Then we're moving into Sarah Croft. We have the Survivor Pack. Honestly, very good. Then we have Little Bird. V-Bucks, both eyes open, honestly, it's a very good spray, also just love the fire type. Then we have the first Jonesy's Field Pack, with the challenges. Then we have Lara Croft herself. The, the skin that was hope that everyone hoped would come last season. We have the Prey Axe. We also have this Goldy Special. Can't really pronounce it. Then Evasive Maneuvers. Again, very good emo. Love that it's transversal. We also have a hundred V books, same as always. Then we have Salvage Shoot, yeah. And we have a banner, our first Gaming Legends banner in-game. Then we have Lara Croft 25th Anniversary. Then we move on to, to Tyranna. Very good rap. Honestly, love the spray. Scoldy Shout. Honestly, I haven't really used it that much. <laughs> Chainsaw used it a lot when I got it at first. 100 V-Bucks, always good. Now, this one really surprised me because this one. Oh, sorry, I need to sit this down somewhere. Okay, we have the Don't Juice Field Pack Jump 15. Sorry, this can get quite annoying sometimes. We don't want it too far, I think. Okay, then we have Jonesy's Field Pack Jump 15. Love the quest. Very hard to f for me to figure out because I thought I was looking for the same thing as the first one. And then we have Tyranna. Honestly, 10 out of 10 skin. Very, very much goes with the season. Bone Patrol, very, very good. 
Then it have Tyranna's banner, which honestly, it's good looking, but then we have, I can't even pronounce this. Then we have Primal Takedown. I have this loading screen equipped for a long time. Then we have the Dino Deck. 100 V-Bucks. And Dino Feather. I'm pretty sure I still have that equipped. Yeah, I do. Then we have the Tyranna X Tran X Transic Armor. Honestly, very good. Like how it's getting more modern. Kinda looks like it's from a bike. Then we have the Crystal Axe of the Masters. The blade is carved from a single zero point crystal. We have Apocalypse. Curse. I'm not sure I have. Okay, I do. Grass, not right now. Then we have Glyph Master. This is actually his selectable style. If you don't know who he is, I'm talking about Raz. Then another 100 B bucks, and then raise up. I honestly have this up. I honestly have this equipped right now. Banner icon, Glyph Mask, Glyph Raider. I love it. Honestly, I have a crypto right now. The Soaring, Soaring, Yeah, I can't say. But it's honestly very good. Just needs a little bit more distinction. And then we have In This School. And this is where me owning the Battle Pass ends. We have 100 V Bucks. We have Chroma, Chroma fr Flame. Then I've been working to get this John J Field Pack Jump 31. It's just, it's hard because it took me mine a long time to update. Raz, another skin. Aussie, love it. 10 out of 10. Very impressive for the storyline. I think Kevin the Cube's coming back. Then we have Quite Curious, and it's very cool because it's actually animated. 100 V-Bucks, and I'm pretty sure this is the first legendary emote we've ever had. It's transversal and built-in, which is pretty cool. Sure, we have ones that change styles, but we don't have ones that are transversal, do we? Then we move on to clock. Wap, rap wave, pretty good. Wing of the hill. I love it, and I can see two other chickens. And I can also see another rabbit and the spire. Also, I don't think that's a skin. We might want to keep a lookout for that. And I have no idea what that is either. Then we have the hatch pack. He got it from his mom. Honestly, very good. Gives us a little backstory for him. Then we have the banner icon. V-Bucks? And then Egger. Just imagine if his name was Edgar. Okay, then we have jo Jones's Field Pack Jump 42. You can see it's kind of getting unstable, like in the live event. Then, we have Cluck. Chirp, 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 chirp the cock. Hmm, not quite sure about that. But if you see right here, when I just take it close up, look right there. You can see probably an upcoming weapon. And according to leaks, it's going to be called the Recycler and use mass as ammo. 
boots and cats are honestly very good at email. <laughs> Always makes me laugh. I just, before the video, I just sat here for like 10 minutes listening to it. Fuck off. Get the joke, not a good one. Then we have drummies. I feel like this is what, kind of a reference to the drum, to the drum, to the drum gun, cause honestly, me and my friends call, call the drum gun a drummy. Probably most, probably a lot of people do. And then we have Eggie, which is honestly just adorable. Then we have looking mad. That was a very close one. Then we have the hatch pack Slurpee edition. It, cha it cha changed all the eggs to metal. It looks like, and it also has a hundred V bucks. Now, Cluck Slurpee. I actually have a theory. If you guys have seen the Slurp Legends pack, because he is currently made out of Slurp, maybe a hint. We move into Raven. Honestly, very good song. Then we have Daughter of Trigon. Love the spray, looks great. I actually get the reference because I'm a big fan of Teen Titans. Then we have Sol Solar Soul Self. Soul and Soul Self. Uh, it's practically a tongue twister. But Raven, that's a Raven. Probably most people knew that. Then we have 100 V Bucks and the power of Enzoria. Whatever it's called. I oh, didn't see that. Ah. Then we have Zero Bloom. Oh, wait. Does anyone else remember when the Zero Point bloomed? Look very closely. Look very closely, and it says Jones in. In the live event, we actually saw um, Jonesy wearing armor that said Jones in. I'm assuming that's the Mandalorian's armor. Or chest plate. Then we have the Rebirth Raven. Then we have X Trail Form. Love the pickaxe, and it's also animated. Love it. We have a hundred V bucks and a Raven's Wrath. Wrath. Yeah. Very good. Love the art style. Then we have a banner icon. Dimensional Gate. And this is actually. Look, I'll let it speak for itself. It's not a built-in emo, which is kind of weird. We have another 100 V-Bucks. And we have the classic Raven. Then we have the Spire's Reach. Then the Spire's Shadow. Then we have a banner icon. Meowsles. That's all I'm saying. Then we have Spire Fire. Then we have Banana Nope. We actually saw that in the Colossal Coliseum, and I know this skin came out, but I just didn't get it. Then we have Kablooman. I find something weird. It's all kind of like in the 80s, which is kind of weird. Then we have 100 V-Bucks and Solar's Reach. It's kind of weird that it's free. As you can see, we're getting close to level 100. We have K 
Canada Crashers, that's what, that's what I'm going to call it. Then we have Spire Master. And dang, that's good. Then we have Spire Flame. We have a banner icon. And we have Spire Spirit. If you didn't know, that's her real face. Level 99, we have 100 V-Bucks. Then we have the Spire Assassin herself. And her belt and emo. That's what her face looks like. So, banner icon, very good. Miss Fish, we've been waiting for this skin so long. Epic, just give us it. Then we have Beef Blade. I can only assume that Tomato Head did this. I can only assume. Then we have Bing Bag. Sacks not included. Oh snap. So, we have Lara Croft. We have the classic, honestly, very smooth. Then we have Tyranna Indigo. Looks good. Then we have Cluck Explosive. I get the joke. Then we have Rachel Raw. Everyone is waiting, Epic. Just, just at least show us what it's going to be. I feel like we all don't know it's probably not going to be Newmar Jr. I'm pretty sure it's the, going to be the foundation. How about you? Comment down below. Peace!